There are many ways to provide extended time on assessments during distance learning. One such method is to create a Google Form or Google Quiz that is editable at a later time for students. These settings apply to any Google Form, whether you've created the assessment or not. If you haven't created the assessment yet, start by clicking on the Create button on Google Classroom's Classwork tab. Choose a quiz assignment from the menu, which will create a new Google Form assignment. Click on the blank quiz that is attached to that assignment. If you've already created the assessment, the steps for adapting it for extended time are the same from here on in. Click on the gear icon to open the settings menu. First, make sure that the Google quiz is collecting email addresses. This will open a couple other options. Select response receipts. This will send students a copy of their work and a link to later edit the quiz during their extended time. To help students keep track of the link, make sure that the response receipt is always sent. This eliminates the possibility that students will forget to request the responses and forget to request the link. Even though the students will be able to edit the assessment later, you should still limit them to one response so they don't try to start multiple copies of the same assessment. The final setting on this tab allows the students to edit after they've submitted. This way the student can submit the assessment at the end of the typically allotted time during the synchronous session and then return to it at a later time to complete their extended time. This link will be sent in the response receipt. There are some presentation options, but none that are required to make it an extended time assessment. Under the quizzes tab, you'll want to limit what the student can see as they're coming and going between the assessment. Turn off missed questions, correct answers, and point values. This way they can make changes but not know what is correct or incorrect as they edit. You can also choose to release the grade manually on this menu. Once you're done with your edits, click on the Save button and your settings will save. Once the allotted extended time is reached, you can always prevent further editing slash submissions by clicking on the Responses tab. This will allow you to toggle between accepting and not accepting responses.